Welcome back, friends, to another non-review video of the Beard Bros. Uh, John, care to elaborate? We're going to be taking two of our favourite beers from Tiny Rabble. We're going to be looking at them and deciding which one of these we would recommend. Today, my friend, we're going for Club Tropica versus Pineapple Express. Now, of course, we review both of these beers separately. On paper, these are very similar beers. They're both IPAs. They're both heavily pineapple related. The nose on both is pineapple with the mango flavors added in on the Club Tropica. The taste on the Club Tropica is tropical. And the taste on the Pineapple Express, I'm gonna blow your minds here, it tastes like pineapple. We just thought we compared them and contrast just to see because yeah, that's what we thought we'd do. So, fuck it, why not? So let's go, is it? Avid viewers out there, Club Tropica is our highest rated beer on the channel. We both rated this one a 9.8, that's about as good as it gets. Before we get started mate, both cans, beautiful cans. Tiny Rebel have got their brand on point here. Either one of these cans, it's eye catching, you look at it, you would want to buy these. At least I would anyway. Shall we uh, open these bad boys up? Let's open them. Ready? Oh, double opening. I'm going to go with the Pineapple Express scent first. I can indeed smell pineapple. They ain't wrong in what they're saying. Are they? What can you smell? John, can you smell the pineapple? I can very much smell the pineapple on this one. Whereas the Club Tropica is kind of pineapple, but again, there's, there's a mango smell, but there's also that kind of coconutty smell to it as well, which again, kind of does fit in. What can you smell on Club Tropica? Club Tropica has uh, slightly got a bit of smell to it, whereas the Pineapple Express is a lot sweeter in smell. Color wise, Pineapple Express is cloudier. Yeah, a little bit more hazy on the Pineapple Express. Club Tropica, slightly less, but it is also cloudy. Much of a much as for these two. Which one should we try first, John? For this one, we need to try the benchmark first. So we need to try Club first. Club Tropica going in, John Ching Ching. Ching Ching, John Ching Ching. That's some good shit, John. Fucking love it. Fucking love it. That is a tasty beverage. The Club, there is a definite more of bitterness to it, the pineapple notes. There is a little bit of a hint of mango. There's a hint there. Overall, beautiful drink. Well does even know its original score. Is it time to crack open the Pamp Express and try that as well? Yes, it is. Let's go, my friend. Ching ching, Jonathan. Ching ching. It's so sweet to smell. Now, after drinking the Tropica John, I can taste a hell of a lot more pineapple in this. It's a lot sweeter. It is. It is a lot sweeter, mate. This smells like pineapple and mango juice. I think this is grapefruit, this one, isn't it? I think that's the other one, isn't it? Oh no, it is grapefruit, okay. Definitely takes mango. Probably is mango somewhere. Well, ignore me. Either way, I can definitely smell mango in this. Fuck no. Anyway, we can taste something else. I can see where you're coming from. You've got that sweet, juicy smell to it, haven't you? This is a prime example of how to do two drinks that are very similar, slightly different ways. This Pineapple Express, when you look at it, it's just a little bit more of a sweet finish to it. Whereas the Club is a bit more of an IPA. There's a little bit more of that bitterness to it when you drink it. The overall flavour, sort of palettes and profiles that you just think are very similar. They've just taken slightly different directions of how they're going to taste. What do you think, mate? Now you've had your second sip. Side by side, John, if I'm totally honest with you, I'm enjoying the Pineapple Express a touch more than our king of the beers over here. We scored it just because i like the sweetness to this it's not over the top but i also do like the the bitterness also the sweetness of the, the club tropica it's a hard decision i'm inclined to agree i think that this can of club tropica that i had in front of me doesn't taste as nice as the one that i remember from the review because the one i remember from the review had very strong taste through it of the pina colada taste that kind of that coconutty tropically taste to it whereas this one it's still a fantastic drink and i'm still very happy drinking this but i don't think that this batch that we have is as nice personally i think this pineapple express is just a very sweet seductive drink we've also got to remember that pineapple express is a 6.2 percent and the Club Tropica is a 5.5. That's where I think the, the strength comes from with the, the Club Tropica is the bitterness of the hot. Oh wait, taking it back. It's the other way around. Well, holy shit. This Pineapple Express is very good. And I think what we've got on our hands at the moment is the worst batch than what we reviewed. 
judging by our previous reviews of these, Club Tropica should be walking this. But this is very close, mate. Very close. Bear in mind, Sean, when it comes to the price of these two, Pine Express is £3 for the 440ml can, whereas Club Tropica sits at £2.30 for the 330ml can. Pretty close considering you get the bigger can, but there is a price difference here. What is your preference right now, Sean? So, John, my preference right now. I'm more inclined to go with the, the Pineapple Express, John. I'm gonna give it to this. I have to. It's just a nice to drink today, just purely because it's got a bit more flavor to it, other than the fact that it's an IPA. You can taste, it's a lot sweeter than the Club Tropica. It could be a worse batch. Right now, with the cans I've got in front of me, I'm enjoying the Pineapple Express a touch more. Just a touch. Yeah, but it is there, the sweetness is definitely there compared to the club. Um, what do you think, John? So I think I'm inclined to review, mate. I think on this occasion, Pine Express is the winner here. We've got a prime example here of this club that we have is worse than that that we reviewed. I think there's any hiding from that. I think the batch on this one is slightly worse and the flavour profile isn't quite the same. The sweetness comes through on it, I think there's a better flavour to it. You know, these two we have here, as soon as we compare them, I think it's nicer. I think the sweetness comes through. The hoppiness of the IPA, which you definitely get when you drink this club, isn't there with the Planet Express. I think they've done a cracking job with it, which is ultimately the probably result, because this isn't the way it should have panned out. I think this is a decisive win for the Pineapple Express. Beyond all reasonable doubt, John, the Pineapple Express IPA has won the war of the Tiny Rebel pineapple drinks. And fuck me, it's nice. Let us know what you think. Which of these drinks you think is better? I think it'd be interesting to potentially revisit this later on and just to see if there's any difference again, in our opinion. If we had done this originally, we could have a different result again. The ultimate thing needs to come from this. Both of these drinks are fantastic. Seriously, if you have not tried either of these drinks, go out make a point of trying these drinks because they are both great. Time to pick. Pineapple Express is our winner, baby. Thanks for watching. Hit that like button, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Thank you. Ooh.